Alright guys, so I haven't shown you my ball pythons in a while, but this is my, um, a couple of my small females. This is my female G-H-I-N-G. Her name is Edith, and this is her, like, first small rat, so that's why I'm pretty excited about it. Pretty stoked. She hasn't taken a small rat yet. This is her first bigger meal, and if you guys have ball pythons or snakes, you know, that's a pretty exciting time for us when they figure out how to take down a little bit bigger prey item. And I always go a little bit longer and give them two or even three, you know, usually about two extra large mice before I give them their first small rat, but she finally figured it out. I'm pretty stoked about it. So I'm finally offering large prey items. Hopefully I'll see some really nice growth. You can see how the scalation actually separates. You can see it in the rows. Um, the skin underneath. But yeah guys, I'm just I'm pretty stoked about this. And then we're doing the same thing over here with her complete opposite. My female fire orange dream. And uh, this is her first. Uh, small rat as well, so I'm pretty geeked about this. I'm gonna go ahead and jump ahead and show you guys her getting it down. But I just wanted to show you since you had uh, knocked this one out, I was pretty geeked about that. It's a little bit of coconut fiber in her mouth here. I'm gonna go ahead and take that out with the tongs. Alright, so I got it out with the tongs, and you can see how it distended her jaw became after eating such a large meal. She's gonna go ahead and re end her jaw here in a little bit, and I just wanted to catch that for my own records anyway. It's just cool. It's just so amazing. I, I don't know, almost therapeutic watching the snake eat, mesmerizing, I suppose. Carl up here, he's going fucking bonkers. Excuse language. This girl's going backwards out of her tub. I hope she doesn't crap on my floor because she already had a big meal, but she's like, it's funny how the struggle with those front legs. I'm trying to get them to fold back once they get a big meal, but uh, Fitzy, she's kind of a champ. And you can see by her size, she can definitely handle small rat at this point. It was all done. She's all set. Love you, girly. Back to Bitsy. She's still backing out of this. Kind of want to get her up back in here. But I don't want her to disturb her while she's eating. She's just going all wanky. It's definitely time, we're just about time for some new toes for these girls. I was, sorry, I was trying to like turn the camera so you can kind of see. They're almost there, they actually, that's why I really like all, like, all pythons. I don't have an up and coming video of why I really, really love all pythons. And it's just something I don't think anybody's ever really thought of before, which is why I'm going to do a video on it and showcase some of these different girls and guys. Okay, so I said no more. <laughs> snake feeding videos, but uh, this is actually one of my pride and joy, and this is from Fred Kick, Fred Kick at Kicks Balls. This is my uh, spot nose yellow belly Mojave.
I'm such a freaking liar. All right, so this is Roche. This is my genetic stripe cinnamon, or cinnamon genetic stripe. Eating her for a small red as well. All three of these girls are kind of growing at the, about the same rate, but she gets an enclosure because she's, <clears throat> uh, she's very special. Very special. For multiple reasons. Multiple, multiple reasons. Anyway. Short, sweet, to the point. She's grubbing her first small rat. Super excited. She's so dark. Nothing. No alien heads, no nothing. She just got a white belly, which I'd like to see that disappear too. Could you imagine a solid black ball python? <laughs> Guys, <laughs> you guys, if you're out there and you're working on it, you need to message me. Stat. Alright, anybody who doesn't think that's cool as hell, screw you. Look how massive she's spreading out. Like I said, the white belly. Oh, guys, I'm having a fabulous night. I hope you are too. Sorry. I keep jumping on here, but uh, sorry, not sorry. Snake feeding is awesome. Why do I have 12 snakes? Because I get to enjoy this almost 12 times. The reason I say almost is because guaranteed you'll have a snake who doesn't want to eat. And that sucks. But everybody else is fat and happy. This girl is just beast, Roche. You're a freaking beast. Look at that. That's nuts. And any of those out there who are vegetarians and think snakes are gross because they eat other animals, I just want to tell you that um, I have thrown cherry tomatoes in my snakes containers before and I haven't had one go after it yet or uh, baby carrots. So uh, until that happens, this is this is kind of the, 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 the circle of life, okay? Okay. Love you guys, peace.